Happy 500 milliliter Monday, everybody. Uh, wife had a little coughing episode, so uh, we never got into it yet, but uh, so we just uh, started to pour this, or I did. This is a real treat. Uh, Kevin Clements uh, sent me a blueberry mead, and this is my very first mead, 2015. Really looking forward to that. Don't know what to expect. I know that they're made with honey and that's pretty well all. Almost smells like a a port to me. I mean like, you know, sort of like a, a wine, but uh, a, a good wine. I like the occasional glass of wine, like um, especially like Black Tower. I love German wines. I'm just going to give it a sniff, give it a taste. Now this is my only interpretation, <laughs> hopefully. I, 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 don't, I don't know, but the, I can only give the interpretation. It tastes like a, a real quality port to me. I mean like... A, if you wanted to, uh, if you like port, to me it tastes like a port, like say. I'm not a very good reviewer. I don't have the greatest uh, taste buds for that, but I know if I like it, and I know if I, I don't like it. And uh, I really like it. A lot. Yeah, I could... Uh, this would be good. Um, a nice winter's winter night, wind blowing and everything, and uh, having a a nice glass like that. I can taste the alcohol in it, in a good way. It's uh, not overpowering at all. And the blueberries, I can taste them. But uh, I've made a lot of different wines before, and uh, you know, good wines. And uh, this is totally different, but uh, that's the closest I can, you know, if someone said, what does mead taste like? I'd sort of say like, you know, a, a port. Yeah, so I'm back again now. Uh, wife's got a terrible cough, poor thing, and uh, she took a little bit of cough spell, so I got her some, uh, some, uh, Buckley's. <laughs> this is an endorsement for you, Buckley's. <laughs> but anyways, oh, I love it, Kevin. Thanks a lot, man. I really appreciate that. I always wanted to try mead, and this is, this is actually better than what I thought. Yeah. It, it is. I'm going to try my hand at that now I'm uh, making uh, mead because well I didn't know I, 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 I didn't know it, do you want to make anything that you really never tasted? I mean like honey here is so expensive I mean you'd be wasting or if, if it was a bad batch you'd be wasting probably fifty sixty dollars and whatever fresh fruit cost and stuff like that so I said no but now that I tasted it wouldn't be a waste at all I know what to expect and I think I'd make a blueberry one too Kevin <laughs> maybe I'll get your recipe <laughs> man this is great anyways thanks everyone for uh, coming along and um, uh, subscribe and uh, comment would uh, appreciate you know I appreciate that and tell me what you think of meads uh, have you had any yet uh, can you buy them in a store I've never ever run across the, I, I live in Canada and I've never uh, ran across the mead I've looked for different beers and 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 and, and different like meads So, uh, thanks for stopping by, guys, and uh, don't forget to subscribe, 
and like and uh, tell me what you think about uh, a, a mead. Can you buy them? Um, I live in Canada. So can you, can, does any Canadians know if you can buy like a mead, first of all? Uh, and on the more personal side, I'd like to thank Kevin Clemens. Uh, I mean, like, when you can get uh, someone like Kevin Clemens and get the, you know, he's been brewing a long time and, uh, and he brews with some of the, as far as I'm concerned, the world's best. And you can get a meat from there. And when I was doing a brew there, I said, it's not, I, I was having a cup, of, a cup of tea and I said, it'd be nice to have a Clemens cup. I said, this is where this started there. And that, I wasn't that I was on the bum or anything there. <laughs> but uh, uh, I was lucky enough to have that. And uh, I put it in the wife's china, by the way, Kevin. <laughs> So that's, uh, I, I just don't uh, uh, throw that in our normal cupboard there. So, anyways, thanks again. I really appreciate that. And uh, thanks everyone for watching and uh, happy 500 milliliter Monday. And uh, hell yeah, go for meads.